Hello, guys! Welcome to Cooking with Liwa! And Bing Zark. No, get out of here. Okay. Anyways, uh, today we're gonna be cooking some... Bing Zark, throw it. Bing Zark. Okay. <clears throat> Mac and cheese! Have you ever been at home and you don't know how to cook craft dinner because you might be stupid or you might be a baby? Well, this is for you. We're going to teach you how to put it in the microwave and be just as good as the regular brand, right, Bing Zach? Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's what we're doing. Bing Zach! All you need to make microwavable craft dinner is KD Craft Dinner Original, Imperial Non Hydrogenated uh, Margarine, Triple Cheddar Cheese, and this bowl. Get out the bowl! What are you doing in the bowl, you eat? First, what you want to do is run the hot water and make sure that it goes that line right there. Right there. There we go. Next up, what you want to do once you have your water filled is pour all the noodles in. Make sure to take that stupid package out and don't be an idiot. Look at all those noodles. Mmm, that's pretty good. Now mix it up. I'm so excited. Do this for a little bit until all your noodles feel separated, and then we can get on to the next step, you idiot. Come on, mix them up. Shake what your mama gave you. Now you're going to want to put it in the microwave. Just plop that sucker right in there, right in the microwave. Nice and good, like that. I want you to suck it. Oh, no. Shut it like that. Then you put your time cook on. For about, eh, give or take, three minutes. So you put it on three, zero, zero, and then you press the start button. So there we go. While you're waiting for your noodles to cook, please have a nice conversation with the person beside you. Once your noodles are done in the microwave, make sure to really get them all mixed up at once again. Really get them separated. Make sure that none of them are connecting with one another. Once you've mixed them again, make sure that you put it back in the microwave for the exact same time as last time. Once it's finished again, get mixing once more. This is the last time we have to do it until we have to put it back in the microwave once again. For the last time. And finally, now that it's done, we shake and stir once more, getting all the noodles nice and ready for our cheesening. Next up, grab a strainer and use the strainer for the noodles that you have just to get all the excess water out of it. Good. Well, now that you have a bunch of no-nonsense noodles, you can finally pour that cheese sauce in. Almost as good as Cheese Whiz, but not really, because Cheese Whiz will always be superior. Mix! Mixing! Mix! Whilst mixing, pour in some extra shredded cheese, just for effect, to get the cheese all nice and cheesed up. And congratulations! You have accomplished your cheesy mission! Now sit back and enjoy your years of childhood depression. Um, I'm not sure that that... Shut up. Thanks for watching, everybody. And next time on Liwa Cooks or Cooking with Liwa, we'll be making a pizza pie. Yes, and I'll be there too. You just shut up.